Okay, hi everybody. I bet you didn't think you'd see me again so soon, but I'm doing way better this week, thank God. It's way better than the last month or so has been. I've had a few really good days and been able to get out more and work on more stuff. And so I just wanted to do a quick update video. This is a kind of a special deal for a friend of mine. Um, it's a Benzo story. And I wanted to tell this mainly because I think that a lot of us, in fact, I think all of us, when we're going through this horrible experience, we think that our experience is the worst and that we are going to die. There is no question about it. And there's nothing that anybody can do to convince us that our experience isn't the worst experience of anybody's on the planet. I did. Everybody I talk to does. So you're not alone with that. But. This next song that I have coming up, I'm releasing off my CD, I wrote for a very, very dear friend of mine who uh, is pretty special. Her and her husband have helped me out a great deal over the last decade or so. I've known him for almost two decades. And I don't know what I would have done without either one of them in my life. They've been very supportive. And Anne has rheumatoid arthritis severe case of it. She's been disabled with it since I met her 20 years ago and she was put on benzos and Ambien around the same time that I was. Um, throughout this whole ordeal she has had numerous joints fused, hip replacements, um, I think knee replacements. Uh, I know she's had multiple surgeries to do all this to just have a little bit of mobility in her hand which is very little. So the reason I'm telling this to you is because she recently went through benzo withdrawal. I think she's on her one year and she's now, I'm helping her taper off the Ambien slowly. Um, I don't know of anybody in my life who has more of a reason to complain about something than she does. Uh, she has to have everyone do everything for her. She can't drive anymore. She is really dependent on um, everyone in her life to do things for her and uh, she always finds the upside in everything she's been the person in my life who's taught me to look at the positives and try to find some reason that things are happening to us the way that they are and I don't recall ever once maybe one time that she ever broke down and started crying in front of me and Every other time she's always so strong and so amazing and I think that uh, she's been a real beacon for anybody who comes in contact with her because I just think that she makes us realize how lucky we really are when you see her situation. Um, part of the reason a lot of this stuff really angers me is because people who are already sick are being put on these drugs and they're getting sicker because they're on the drugs and it's impairing their autoimmune conditions and other things along with what the drug itself just does by itself without any other conditions. So I wanted to share this video that I made for her because I think that I wrote it during this last wave that I had over the last month or so. I got really down you know, for a couple weeks and I know you guys realized I wasn't on doing videos or anything like that but I did uh, get it recorded and finished the last couple weeks my engineer got the mix back to me today and I wanted to dedicate this song to everybody out there not just her because we all need someone to help pick us up and dust the edges off when we're really going through difficult times like we do with these benzos and it's not just a few difficult times it's a long long arduous journey back from these drugs and it's I'm just so very grateful for all the people that helped me and the other people doing the type of work that I'm doing like Don Killian who has repeatedly given me support through email and helped me realize what kind of adjustments I needed to make to get into a better healing place and I took some downtime for myself this last month and I really did a lot of soul searching and writing and this song was kind of a result of this wave 
and I wanted to share it because I think that a lot of you need to hear things to pick you up and that's why I do this kind of stuff that's why I make these videos that's why I do everything with my nonprofit and my work that I do because I think it's important I think a lot of people are being impacted by these drugs and they don't know it they don't know like we know and so they're in the dark and they're running from doctor to doctor trying to get answers and they don't until they try to come off the drug and then you get big answers but not the kind of answers you want to get so um, I wanted to just do kind of a short little hi for the week and let you know I'm doing really good this week I've been able to do a lot today I feel really good and I just wanted to get on and put up my new video and say thanks to all of you guys who um, checked on me and that uh, been a support for me too because helping you has helped me a lot it's given me a reason to keep going and to keep writing so it's what I do I'm really really blessed to have creative juices to flow into my life and distract me from all of the crazy stuff that's going on with my body and in the world and so I just wanted to leave you with this song and say hi and wish you all speedy healing and whatever I can do to help just let me know so thanks and take care of yourselves I'll talk to you again soon bye Can't say when I might see you again Cause this road's been mighty long And the journey has no end I can't seem to find my way again And for days the darkness was my only friend Pick me up and lay me down forever I need to rest my weary heart It took my breath away And for now I've seen some better days So pick me up Tell me that you'll never leave behind my broken heart I can't say why this seems to last forever Cause the valleys are so wide and there's nothing left inside I can't seem to reach the other side And for days it seems like all I did was cry Pick me up and lay me down forever I need to rest in my weary Took my breath away And for now I've seen some better days So pick me up And tell me that you never Leave behind my broken